Hello everyone, welcome back to Azure SQL Mastery and in this video, I will show you how to use extension to add more functionality in Azure Data Studio. So let's take an example. You are a SQL Server DBA and you want to create a jobs in Azure Data Studio or you want to troubleshoot a SQL problem using the SQL profiler or you want to generate a script for your database object or you want to create a backpack and backpack file for your database or you want to import a text file or a CSV file to database. Now there is no direct facility is available in Azure Data Studio. So if you go here and right click, sorry, uh, right click. So only we have few options compared to SSMS. Okay, so if you compare, uh, if you check the in a SSMS, we have a multiple folders, database, security, server object, replications, management, integration service catalog, SQL Server agent, right? But in Azure Data Studio, we have only three options, database, security, and server object, okay? So uh, in SSMS, using the SQL Server agent, you can schedule a job, okay? Uh, using uh, the database option, you can generate a script for your database, or you can create a backpack file or backpack file, or you can import and export files but in azure data studio only you have a limited features okay now as a dba you want to achieve the same functionality in azure data studio because the ssms is available only for the windows but the azure data studio is available for mac user windows user as well as the linux user because it's a cross-platform tool so now you can achieve through marketplace and you can search a extension based on your requirement so for example the first recommended tool so there are total 56 extension is there but it will keep growing every day okay so let's take an example the admin pack for sql server so using this extension you can achieve a full requirement for server agent where you can schedule a job SQL Server Backpack file, where you can create a Backpack Backpack file, or SQL Im Server Import, where you can import a CSV and text file, SQL Server Profiler, where you can troubleshoot a, your SQL problem. So let's install uh, this extension. So to install an extension, just click on an install button. So now this extension is installed successfully. Let's quickly check. So go to the connection, right click and click a manage. So when you click a manage, it will open a server level dashboard. And here you can see in the administration section, there is a SQL agent where you can schedule a job through Azure Data Studio. Similarly, let's check the other functionality. Select the database folder, click on any of this database and right click. You see now we have a two more features are added import wizard and a data tire applications. So data tire application is on, uh, used for the backpack and backpack file and import wizard is useful when you want to import your CSV and uh, text file. Now, okay, here also you see uh, there is uh, one more feature is added called a launch profiler where you can troubleshoot uh, your SQL Server problem. So the launch profile is in, uh, in SSMS we have a SQL Server profiler. It's it's the same. Okay. Now let's install one more extension called a database administration tool extension for Windows user. This uh, extension is basically used to generate a script. Okay, layer to generate a script of your database object. Okay, so now the extension is installed. Let's quickly check. Right click, select a database and right, uh, right click and generate a script. So here now, uh, using this feature, you can select your database object and you can generate a script. This is a similar to the SSMS generate script feature. Okay, now there are many more extensions. There are total 56 extensions are there. Based on your requirement, you can install it. For example, manage instance dashboard where you can manage your Azure database PowerShell command. So if you want to run your PowerShell command through Azure Data Studio, 
you can add this extension. Thank you very much and see you in the next video. I hope you will add more and more features in Azure Data Studio using this marketplace. See you in the next video.